Ernest Simpkins is a man who receives the Caddy Waiver Program um, and also receives case management services through the Brain Injury Association of Minnesota. Um, he will and does receive his case management services, but in order for him to receive PCA or um, other services that will support him ongoing, he actually needs a physical address. I stand that I had to go through a shelter myself. I went to like the Salvation Army and from there to other friends and you know back and forth but thanks to you know the org being there for me they gave me some hope and we help people eligible for medical assistance home care or uh, waiver services to move to homes of their own as an alternative to corporate adult foster care as an alternative to homelessness that otherwise need assistance in, in finding a home of their own. People should be in their communities rather than institutions. First, it's just a practical issue. It's cheaper, it's more cost effective for a person to live in their own home and receive the supports that they need. There are substantial cuts that have been proposed. The legislature basically is taking hundreds of millions of dollars out of the overall budget for persons with disabilities. We're going to be serving people uh, not up to the level that we've had at this point, and they'll become isolated in their own homes if they don't have access to transportation, health care, uh, employment, and other things that Minnesota has been a leader in the nation in, in providing up to this point.